So I'm Ashley Van Creeken, Director of Yarra Rangers Tech School. This tech school is one of 10 tech schools created by the Victorian Government with the purpose of having industry, community and schools work together on developing programs designed to get students to think about careers and understand the skills and technologies that they'll be using when they enter the world of work. But the tech tours form part of that model of the tech schools, of wanting to introduce students to the world of work and to the careers. One of the best ways to do that is have the students go along and actually see a real world site, actually hear from apprentices, hear from managers, hear from staff in those sites about what they do, how it works, but probably most importantly is their pathway. How have they got to where they're getting? So I think the one thing I'd like students to take away from the experience is a broadened understanding that there's not just one way to enter an industry or enter a career. There's multiple pathways and there's multiple opportunities. So if you don't at first succeed one way, there's always another way to get in there. And that typically most people in industry will not be in the job they thought they would be in when they left school. Um, I'm Craig Taylor of Mobile Automation. Uh, mobile Automation do electrical services, um, automation controls PLCs, um, we do energy efficiencies and obviously automation with robotics. Um, basically we covered um, opportunities in industry for um, their career pathways. Um, I think it's critical to let them know that there are jobs out there locally that are uh, within the technical space, robotics, automation and so forth for their futures. For personally from me uh, and the organisation I suppose as well, um, we hope they take away a, a little further understanding of, of opportunities. Um, I feel that a lot of young people these days don't know what is available to them um, and hopefully this exposes those opportunities and, and gets them thinking a little bit more. I'm Chris Bhargav. Um, I work for Cummins Filtration. I have been here for 15 years. Cummins Filtration is a part of a, a global company, Cummins Inc. Um, so globally we manufacture big diesel engines. I'll just take away one thing from visiting today, what would you like that to be? Um, I would say probably exposures to the uh, working environment and corporate world. Obviously have an understanding of all the corporate worlds and the, what the company structure looks like. I'm Stuart Kearney, I'm the Apprentice Master here at Anchor Machine Tools. We uh, build CNC tool cutting and grinding machines for various industries. Today we had the tech uh, school tour come through to uh, see how careers are uh, linked up with industry and schools to give them an idea of the future pathways. Uh, if there's one thing I'd like them to take away is that you're not stuck with one option for life. Make sure you research, find out what you want, ask questions. Um, and there's so many pathways to choose from. Hi, I'm Max. And I'm Arshia, we're both. We're both year tens at Royal Bar College. I was kind of like skeptical, like how it was gonna work and like what we were gonna see. But like throughout the day, it was like really amazing how much we actually got to see behind the scenes and, and how they work. Yeah. Well, it was a lot more than I was originally expecting because we, a few weeks before going for a tour at ARB, we got to see their facilities and these were just the next thing up. It was really impressive. I really liked the uh, the um, anchor, the, the CNC factory. It was really cool um, showing like how how big and like how much effort they're putting into making those machines. For me it was anchor as well. It was I never even thought to consider the factories that make the actual machines themselves. So of course it's just massive scale. Ask career questions um, because I feel like that's really what, like, especially this kind of age, you're trying to figure out what you want to do, where you want to go, um, and this is a great opportunity to see what it's going to look like in the future. Well, open mind, just make, ask as many questions as you can, look at as much as you can, and just have a look at it, really.